first round with 26. Wickham at 28. Gosh, it looks so easy, It Ryan. does. Well, one of the things Sabrina's talked about shooting this year for the Liberty, if she's never had this many open shots before in her career, obviously Brianna Stewart creates that gravity, and it's created a lot of practice for shots like that. She just cashed in on the entire money ball rack. on fire. This is ridiculous. She's already up to 31 in the corner. This is incredible. Sabrina Ionescu, you bet. Back Benley. Here's Clark, a good look from three. She got it. The first three in the career of Caitlin. Defense as well. Here's Clark off a screen, gets a look, and hits. Moving, drags out Nelson Adota. Clark will fire and hit the three. Caitlin Clark. Gets bumped, will take, and hit from three. And Clark. Clark, step back three, knocks it down. Take a look here at a career first. Just step back, going right, I may add. It's usually step back, going left. Develops uh, the ability to slow down and see what works for them in the half court. Oh my goodness, come on. Single digits or in single digits going into the fourth. Okumpa Wale says, Yeah, I hear you and all Monica, but let me just let me just really and into the hands of Agumba Wale. Kyla Charles into the game for Seattle for the first time tonight. And Agumba Wale hit one from that exact spot about three minutes ago. There's Horston all the way to the window, a little strong on that layup though. Coming the other way, it's a track meet up and down the floor. Agumba Wale loves it. She shows the three to everybody. He does it very, does very it well. So well. I mean, how could we not have him read the promos with that kind of execution? Oh boy, it's getting thick in here. <laughs> Agumba Wale. Oh, Dana Jones, you don't want to make that pass in that scenario. Agumba Wale steps it back. Shimmy mistake. Here's Taras. <laughs> Count all three of those. Done. Tarasi left alone. And that's like a layup for Lexi Brown in this second half. Deep three from Tarasi. But gets that one to fall. Tarasi, it's her quarter. Ball, but another turnover there. They're up to 14 now. Tarasi, she's got 20 tonight, and you can add to it. Offensive rebound number seven for the Mercury. Tarasi, give her chases it down. The first look, a ring at home for Kayla McBride. 200 three-pointers. Now to Carlton, six seconds on the shot clock. McBride, deep three-pointer. Didn't get training camp with this team as well. Lexi Brown going to be headed back to the scorer's table for L.A. McBride, quick trigger. Lloyd, who now has 20 points. Jewel Lloyd's just taking things into her own hand. In the first quarter of play, he's got those five turnovers. Offensive rebound, what a spark! McBride, three ball go! In out, she's going to have to learn to high jump rather than long jump. McBride. Sometimes will say, I'm not ready to go out, and she will put in that effort to stay in the game at all costs. Oh, it was cutting in the lane, the kick out to McBride for the three-point try. Here in this third quarter, Carlton kicking it to McBride. Long three. McBride with the three-point try. 12, cut it all the way to one, and they'll have to do it again in the fourth. McBride. Here's Collier, now a Koopa. The bounce pass to Collier, extra pass, swinging around, McBride open for three. Blocked by Smith, who's having a terrific day at the office. Collier kicking it to McBride, and she has tied her season high. Start the season. Young gets it over to Plunk. He knocks it down. This is Smith going in that matchup with Clark. He gets it out to Plum, left wide open, and she makes some pay. Three. U.S. team will be on the five on five U.S. team and they hope to see more of that. A big Iowa fan as you mentioned and has brought that into the WNBA. She had a jersey on today. We saw her shoot around. Plum from dis distance again. Asia Wilson chases it down. Plum, new season high. 